much have we missed live concerts throughout this pandemic? Can you believe it's been an, over a year since we've seen some live music around here? Well, the fact that concerts are coming back is definitely music to our ears. And with the Blossom Music Festival making a big comeback, our January Keaton talked with organizers about what's new for the return. We perform for audiences and we can't wait to have them back. And we can't wait to come back. COVID kept it away for a year, now an old Cleveland favorite calling for us to come sit on the lawn and kick back with some classical music favorites. It's really exciting. We spent a year, um, we've been doing different things. We've been streaming and doing digital work, but it, having an audience, having a good audience and a big audience in place is what we do. Starting 4th of July weekend, the Cleveland Orchestra will play concerts again for a live audience in a long-awaited return to the Blossom Music Festival in Cuyahoga Falls' picturesque Cuyahoga Valley National Park. Ten weeks of international music stars and fan-favorite conductors, not to mention the uber-talented musicians, and of course, still gotta follow COVID rules. The state and the governor have mandated that we, we can perform at 30% of capacity, which um, takes a 19,000 seat venue down to about 60, 6,500, 6,000, something like that. We figure we can do 4,500 in the lawn and about 1,500 in the pavilion. Which means expect limited capacity seating, also wear your mask and maintain the typical six feet of space from others. All of that still applies, even outdoors. Staff will be obeying COVID protocol too, so that everyone can enjoy America's finest orchestra safely. <laughs> That's right. Now, Ross Benny, who you saw there in the piece, he mentioned that 30% capacity is all they're allowed to have. Well, as we all know, the state has lifted that mandate on outdoor venues. So now, he said, the 1,500 that he mentioned that will be in the pavilion area, that's going to stay the same because they still have to maintain six feet of social distancing there. But the 4,500 capacity outside on the lawn, he said that will increase as the summer season approaches. They don't know exactly what that number will be in the final tally, but for now, 4,500 on the lawn will likely increase. Go to our website, WKYC.com, if you want more information on all of this information. <laughs> Live at Cuyahoga Falls, January Keaton, 3 News. It is the perfect venue for this as things begin to open up again. Lots of elbow room for yes. folks. January, thank you so much.